Hey everyone, Kaylee here with two no bobby pin ways to wrap your hair around your ponytail. I don't know about you, but I hate using bobby pins to do that, so I have two methods that we can try to go ahead and not use bobby pins to get the same effect. So the first one, you're going to go ahead and secure your hair into a loose ponytail, and then wrap your one strand around. And then after you've wrapped it around a sufficient amount of times, you want to create a half knot. And this just helps to get the rest of the hair going straight down so it doesn't stick out to the side. Then take one loop of the hair elastic, put two fingers through it, grab the piece of hair, and pull the hair back through it. And then if the elastic is still showing, just kind of um, pull the ponytail back up and then pull the wrap down over it and it is hidden nicely. And that is it for this little method. Now I have some pros and cons. For the pros, um, it's quick, it doesn't require any extra bobby pins, but for the cons, it has to be a loose elastic, which means that the ponytail might not stay as well, and it adds a lot of little frizzies and it's kind of messy, so it's not my favorite. The one that I do really like is method number two. So for method number two, you're going to start out the same way. You're going to take your little piece of hair and wrap it around. And so then for this demonstration, I didn't do the half knot um, just to show you what it would look like if you didn't. So you can just wrap until you're satisfied with how it looks and how many times you wrap the hair around. Once you've got it where you want it, go ahead and take a clear elastic, a very, very small one, and wrap it just underneath where you want that wrap to be. And make sure that you're including the end of the hair that we wrapped around in that elastic. Once you've completed that, go ahead and tighten the ponytail so that it slides up. Then slide the hair down over it, and you've got your little wrap. And this one is a lot neater. You can see there's a lot less extra little frizzies around the elastic, which is kind of a little bit better, and it also doesn't disrupt the ponytail at all. So that's my favorite part about that one, and that is my favorite method of the two. And that is it for today's really quick little tip tutorial. I hope you guys like it. Make sure to check out my previous video, which is on a wet hairstyle, which I love. And I will see you guys on Friday with my next video. Mwah. Bye!